Hello guys, welcome to today's video tutorial at Trust Stanley's TS Tech Talk video. Today guys, I'm going to be showing you how to set up your uh, appointment on your Facebook page using your Facebook application. So, so far I've been making use of my Facebook application to create every tutorial which I've been working on. So, um, I hope you guys get what I'm trying to do. You can also do this with your um, Facebook app if you want to, but right now I'm just showing how you can manage your Facebook application instead of having so many apps installed on your device that consume space so let's dive into creating our appointments so make sure you have a facebook page already that you want to add this appointment click on it now appointment allows you to schedule the time your free time whenever you're going to be free for appointment or whenever you're going to be available for appointment so anybody can easily book an appointment with you and this is going to be specially made for um let me say people that offer services such as web designing tech tutors or maybe um a travel agency or if it's a psychologist or anybody that does that does um, booking and att attend attendance stuff like so let's go ahead and click on this more option and then you can notice where it says appointment go ahead and select that so now um since we are going to be entering this for the first time you are going to actually set up our appointment date and time which we are going to be available for this so all you need to do is to click on the getting started if this is the first time you are actually clicking on that so click on getting started you can notice it says um show your available appointment date um show your available appointment schedule and share your appointment availability so that people can book anytime so go ahead and click on next wait for it now you have option to select all your appointment date um days of the week which are going to be available so first of all select the days of the week which are going to be available usually i'll be available on sundays mondays no tuesdays i i'm going to be available on tuesday but not every time actually so i'm not i'm not actually going to be available like every days of the week so let me say i'm going to be available two times in a week so i'm going to give space so that i'll be able to have my time but fridays no i don't like um responding sometimes fridays anyway let me leave that so after selecting the date you can go ahead and select the time and then um don't forget this particular option right on the top area that says your time zone if you are not currently in africa because it facebook application automatically dictates your location and gives the specific time zone which you are currently at so if you are not in africa you can go ahead and click on the time zone set whichever time zone you are currently on go ahead and search for the city if that is um let me say new york you can see you click on new york and it will be displayed so it will be using new york time zone but i'm currently on you or uh, i'm currently not in new york so i'm going to go ahead and revert this back to lagos nigeria so what that's lagos nigeria so i'm good with this so it's africa slash lagos so now look at the date try to pick a specific date and time which are going to be available and i'm mostly available around from 9 a.m and nine o'clock a.m to no i would not be available for chat at that time 5 30. that's good so actually i i don't know we are supposed to select the same time i'm going to go ahead and select the same time so i'm going to pause this video to select the same time for that instead of making it very long so i'm done with the time all I need to do now is to click on the next option, wait for it, it's loading. So now you can notice it says appointment approval to be set or manual or if you don't want it to be set or manual, you can leave it on automatic. So 
it's going to be set to automatic so whenever anybody um books an appointment it's going to automatically going to be set or choose a particular time or date for the person but i don't want that i want that to be a manual because you know i might be busy at that particular time so i need to be able to reschedule so that i won't be able to miss an appointment so if i want to be able to keep up with them and then you can notice another option that says double booking client can book appointment um time that I already have book have booking that means if somebody already booked an appointment another person can also book an appointment so if you want that you can go ahead and select that that's if your appointment have to be if you can multitask and communicate with different appointments or different people at the same time you can go ahead and select that option but if not go ahead and choose the one that best suits you so if you want this to actually get a reminder on your device you can go ahead and choose this google calendar calendar which allows you to synchronize your google account or your gmail account and be able to be able to get notification with or um with your account with your facebook account so if you want that leave this option selected and then go ahead and log into your email account but i don't want that particular option right now i'm just going to leave that off but i just chose it so that you guys will know how it works you guys can go ahead and select any option which you think best suits you so next click on save wait for it so now um you can notice it already added up and you can see another option for us listing um your services so um go ahead and click on next so that you list your services and if you notice i didn't have any services on my um on my page already so i'm going to go ahead and add that so um let me go ahead and add some services that I also offer because I'm also a web developer and I can still design website. If you notice, that's what I've been putting so far. So let me say web design and then fist price. If it's a fist price, you can leave it as a fist price, but if you want it to be negotiable, you can just say starting at. So click on that so that people can easily price and then all this kind of stuff. So let me say 35. This is 35,000 Naira in Nigerian currency. You can convert that to your own currency to know. So um, that should be um, the services you are going to offer for this particular appointment. That's when the person is booking an appointment. This is the exact amount he's going to pay. And that is the duration the person is going to last. So since it's something that I have to do with that, so um, web designing and let me go ahead and reduce this. I think it's a bit too high. Uh, let me see. Starting at 3,000 Naira. Okay. Starting at 1,000 Naira. Just make it more realistic. So um, it won't chase people off. But depending on you anyway, you can just go ahead and enter whatever you want. So um, show services is going to be displayed and you can also go ahead and include images does if you want to. But if not, just leave that off. But let's leave an image so that it will make it look a bit catchy. Let me go ahead and select a web designing image. Go ahead and click on done. I'm okay with this. So... Um, let's put a little description to get um people to understand so right, he's not typing. so i just added one saving it up 